Hey, good day, good day, good day. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for joining me. Just in case you join me for the very first time, I'm your host, The Real Brian Glades Gibbs. Smash the like button. Subscribe, share, support. Hey, I was once the problem. Now what I seek to do is, oh man, I'm too old. I'm trying to be part of the solution to give back. You know, today what I'm talking about is this, man. Imagine, you know, you listen to different situations, circumstances, or whatever, and you listen to people being kingpins. So you know what? Guess what? If you saw a snowfall, look what happened to Franklin Saint. You know what? Here it is. He was worth millions flying on jet plane. Then look what happened right now. At the end of the result, he didn't get murdered. He didn't go to jail. He wanted being a derelict. He wanted being an alcoholic. He wanted being a bum. You know what? That's not for everybody. Like even right now, I'm going to talk about Lorenzo Fat Cat Nichols. Okay? Here it is right now. Anybody from the East Coast heard about him. You know, you got all these rappers speaking about him. You know? 50 Cent talking about doing his um, movie, you know what I'm saying, serious about his life. But anyway, right now was, guess what? When Cat caught the case, he caught a case in 1985 and he got violated. And he went back to Sing Sing. Anybody know anything about Sing Sing, man? It's all type of story about Sing Sing. You know, from, you know, when my man, what's his name, you know I'm saying right now, all the gangsters, you know what I'm saying, Lucky, Lucky, uh, Lucky Luciano, all of them was in Sing Sing. And Sing Sing got a horror story. But anyway, right now, when Fat Cat was a kingpin and he got violated and he caught a new case, guess what? He wound up back in Sing Sing. You know, okay? Sing Sing is the closest facility closest state facility that's closer to the metropolitan area but right now why he was in there here it is he got busted with ten thousand dollar in cash while he was in sing sing so sit back and think about it, like damn man hold up ten thousand dollars you in prison and you got ten thousand dollars what the hell he where you get ten thousand dollars from mom line the game don't stop people do not understand guess what drugs right now was Drugs, is the, the, the amount of drug and the product of drug and the quantity of drug in prison is worth twice, triple the amount than it's worth on the street. Because once again, it had to be smuggled in. So once again, while he was in there, he had people doing things for him. You know, he was getting all type of food. You know what I'm saying right now? He's getting anything that he want, you name it, he got in there. And what I'm getting, because you gotta sit back and think about it. You got correction or something. And guess what, man? Here it is, you giving these guys Whatever they want, you paying their mortgage, you pay their car notes, you putting their kids through school, you taking care of their scholarship, you taking care of all that. So when you take care of all that, guess what? These guys is in bed with you. So they're going to do what you need them to do because you're the boss and you can pay them. Right now, why is somebody going to jeopardize their salary? jeopardize their livelihood because once again you make them an offer they cannot refuse so right now he's in there so you name it he got it food drugs um like hey 007 even probably a pistol you name it he's getting in music you name it so once again like i said right now is these guys are bringing it in but when you look at it and you sit back and think about it now everybody's not always on the tape you got some people that's gonna be on the tape some people not gonna be on the tape so what he did was, he got knocked. They had a, you know say, shakedown. And right now, when they got a shakedown, you don't know when it's coming, but it come periodically. And based upon him being high profile, when that shakedown came, you know what I'm saying, right now, early in the morning, and right now they bust into the cell, guess what? And they found $10,000 in cash. Man, you know how much egg was on people's face? You know what type of investigation probably took place? Because once again, you know, they start centering, who the hell know this man? Or uh, who the hell is from his geographical area? Like for simple, because I'm going to look at it, man. Who's from South Jamaica, Queen, that's worked for, you know what I'm saying, Sing Sing, that worked for the, the state correction officer? Who? Because once again, I want to know right now was how in the hell this man got $10,000 in cash? Right now was who bringing in the contraband for him? Who, you know what I'm saying right now, is like the basic they're doing the dirt for him because once again they know he can't bring it in but somebody was bringing it in for him man but like i say folks listen man you sit back and think about it like i told you right now Wiz, he didn't end up like franklin saint right now he got the opportunity probably in another what eight more years of getting out after spending close to damn near 50 years in the penitentiary and guess what folks it wasn't worth it man I don't care what anybody said right now with guess what? Trying to be out there and being a gangster. You know, here it is. You want to be a street legend. You want to be a street legend. But then again, you fail in life. 
Right now, if you're a bum, if you spend the rest of your life in jail, or you die in the street of a violent death, guess what? You was a failure in life. If you wasn't there for your family when they need you, you're a failure in life. Hey, hit the like button, subscribe, share. One love, the real Brian Glaze Gibbs.